Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Jaffer Jackson transforms into his late uncle Michael Jackson and sports king of Pop's trademark military jacket while filming on set of upcoming biopic in downtown LA. Jaffer Jackson looked like the spitting image of his uncle Michael Jackson while filming the upcoming biopic Michael about the late musician on Saturday. The 27-year-old actor was seen on set in downtown Los Angeles and dressed in a navy blue military jacket with gold details, inspired by the king of pop's trademark style. He sported black cropped trousers with stripes down the sides as well as tall socks and black loafers just like the music icon, who passed away at the age of 50 in 2009, used to wear. He also sported a pair of oversized aviator sunglasses as he transformed into his uncle to film the upcoming biopic titled Michael. In recent weeks, Jaffer had also been seen filming on set in Havenhurst, the Jackson compound in Los Angeles's Encino neighborhood where Michael and much of his family lived beginning in 1971. During production on Saturday, he appeared to be filming a scene where he was greeting hordes of fans as he stood atop a car and stopped traffic over in downtown Los Angeles. As many people swarmed to meet him, Jaffer, playing Michael, was seen smiling and waving to the crowd. The scene the dancer-turned-actor was filming appeared to have been set sometime in the 80s based on his outfit, longer hair wig and the vintage cars that had been assembled on the street. Previously, he had been seen filming scenes set in the 70s, early in Michael's career. The upcoming biopic, which is set to be released on April 18, 2025, co-stars Coleman Domingo as Joe Jackson and Miles Teller as Michael's attorney and future estate executor John Branca. The film is expected to cover much of Michael Jackson's life, including allegations in the 1990s that he had sexually abused children. In 1993, he was accused of sexually abusing the 13-year-old Jordan Chandler, whom he had befriended after renting a car from his stepfather. Police investigated after Chandler told a psychiatrist that Jackson had abused him, though the investigation was dropped due to a supposed lack of evidence. Chandler's family sued Jackson in September 1993, before reaching a settlement early the next year. Afterward, the family stopped cooperating with police, leading to the closing of the investigation, and Jackson was adamant that he was innocent. In March, Dan Reed, who directed the documentary Leaving Neverland about the child sexual abuse allegations that dogged Jackson, called the upcoming biopic startlingly disingenuous after reading a draft of its screenplay. Jackson is only ever seen caring for children with childhood cancer, or dancing with a little girl in a wheelchair, or tucking up multiple little boys, mostly his nephews, at sleepovers, Reed told Variety. It feels like the creators of the movie have been stuck in a room with John Branca and just told what to write. Also in March, Michael's son Prince, 27, was spotted visiting the cast and crew during early production days on the set of the biopic. According to Variety, a source close to production stated that at least one other member of the family, besides Jaffer, is always on set every single day of filming. In early February, Prince shared his excitement over the Antoine Fuqua-directed project, which was announced last year, and showed his support for his cousin taking on the role. On Instagram, he had shared a photo of Jaffer as he recreated an iconic snapshot from Michael's Dangerous World Tour in the 90s as captured by photographer Kevin Mazur. In his caption, he wrote, Super excited to share with y'all the first look of hashtag Michael movie starring my cousin at Jaffer Jackson. This project has had so many special moments for me and everyone involved. Source, dailymail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.